Nearly two weeks since Haiti was hit hard by that massive earthquake that killed more than 2,000 people and injured thousands of others. And we've also been reporting on the desperate need for help in that region. That's why Rosen Hotels is holding a collection drive this weekend in hopes of getting those residents some more very important supplies. Joining us today is Harris Rosen, president of Rosen Hotels. I want to thank you so much for being here with us this morning. It's my pleasure. Thank you, sir. All right. So we know that you've done work with Haiti in the past. Uh, what inspired you to want to help out again this time? Well, we've been involved with Haiti for many, many, many years. Started many years ago with water filtration systems that we distributed throughout Haiti. And then, of course, right after Hurricane Matthew, we were there to see the horrible, horrible devastation. In fact, uh, we were so taken by what we saw that we um, offered to rebuild over 105 homes from scratch. And then we went back and visited the homeowners, and that was a wonderful, wonderful visit we had. Um, and I, I can't imagine, you know, we've seen a lot of this uh, devastation uh, in news reports, but for you to be there firsthand with some of these previous uh, events that have happened, I mean, I can't imagine what that was like. Well, it was it was horrible uh, to see that devastation it was absolutely uh, incredibly sad, uh, but it inspired us to do something, not just to feel badly. Uh, but about 20 percent of our associates are from Haiti. We have a very, very close relationship with our brothers and sisters in Haiti. We, we love Haiti so much. We have tried desperately to get H2B immigration extended so that our Haitian brothers and sisters could come and stay with us and be employed. And we're working on that diligently with uh, Congresswoman uh, Deming. All right, so uh, a cause uh, and an island and a community that's very near and dear to you. Uh, talk to us about this weekend's drive. If anyone's watching at home right now, what types of supplies can they bring and where can they bring them? Well, that's a great question. And uh, let me offer uh, a website. It is rosengivesback.com slash Haiti. And if they do that, they will see a very detailed list of everything that uh, we would hope and pray that uh, they would uh, bring to us at Rosen Plaza on Saturday from 10 to 4. Uh, that's what we're hoping for and praying for. All right. Uh, if people are not able to stop by this weekend or drop off any items, uh, but they'd like to help out, uh, can they make a donation or are you guys only accepting items? Well, for the time being, it would, it would make life a lot easier for us if, if, if they would um, it, adhere to uh, uh, what we're planning. But yes, of course, they could they could come by Rosen Plaza anytime uh, and, and just offer what, what they would like to offer for Haiti. OK, uh, I want to thank you again for taking the time to talk with us this morning. Uh, is there anything else you want to add that I may not have asked you or touched upon? Well, listen, thank you so much um, um, for having me on. We love Haiti. We love our brothers and sisters. They have struggled for so many years and we just want to offer a helping hand. All right. Thank you again for so much that you're doing to help so many communities and families in need. Thank you so much. God bless.